up? My name is Tyler. I'm a third year computer science student at Georgia Tech and we are back on campus for spring of 2022, which sounds really weird to say, but we are back. And it's my first semester since COVID hit where pretty much all of my classes are in person actually going to them. So that's been so refreshing and nice. Up first, we have a class in the College of Business. Even though I'm a CS major, I'm taking some business classes. More on that in a little bit. Also, it is not super early in the morning. It is actually at night. I filmed this intro, but I looked dead inside and I was still practically asleep. So here's this one and enjoy the rest of the video. Bye. It's Georgia cold, but it's cold, but it's fine. I don't know, I like the, I like the walk a lot. This is my, my favorite part about the day. I get to like see tech campus, see the field, walk around, nice and relaxing. so different taking a business class this semester. Um, I normally have all taken like my CS classes. I don't know if it's actually a different atmosphere or if it's just nice, new, and refreshing because all my other classes are so CS heavy. Either way, I'm really enjoying it. And if you have the time on your schedule, definitely would recommend taking some sort of something unrelated to whatever your major is because it's super fun and the pressure is just not there, which is really nice. Now I'm gonna head back to my apartment because I have not eaten anything today and then we're off to the next one. I'm also super excited because I haven't had breakfast in the last couple days. Because the sponsor of today's video, my green powder hasn't been here. I kid, I kid you not, it is the best way to start your morning. No, this stuff is actually really good. Um, it's like vegetable powder and it sounds and looks disgusting, but it tastes better than it looks. I mean, it's not a mango smoothie but it's better than it looks, and I have not been eating in the mornings because I haven't had this, so anything's an improvement for that. Anyway, I'm starving. I have a meeting in 15 minutes, and then have class right after that, so we're gonna get this done. I feel like I had something else to talk about. Oh yeah, my meeting. So I'm on the GT social media team, and we have a meeting for that. Basically, I post on the Instagram and stuff like that, which is a really fun job. I don't know why I said it like that. Uh, basically, I, if it is in fact a fun job. Let's try that again. Basically, I post on the GT Instagram account and some other accounts. I go to like sporting events, other events. It's really fun. Recently, these guys came out with me for a snow day where it snowed on campus for the first time in a couple years. So we posted for that. Uh, gave out some stickers on campus. Uh, yeah, but it's our first meeting back for the semester. All right, this is the green juice I was talking about. It looks disgusting. I'll give it that. But tastes fine. Good, like, Alright, see you guys. Enjoy your show. So after I eat and have my meeting, I have a class called Startup Lab, and it's basically my junior design requirement in an entrepreneurial sense. And what I mean by that is we like get in groups, we find a problem we want to solve, and we try and create a startup out of solving that project. So it's really entrepreneurial. It's like a it's through CreateX at Georgia Tech. It's like an invention type entrepreneurial process. Anyway, I have that class at 12.30. And before that, I need to go interview some people actually for that class. We're in the like customer discovery, problem safe based discovery process where we formed a group, I'm with four other people, and in the next week we have to interview 100 people collectively on what their different problems are in our problem space. We're tackling something college related. Actually, I'm excited to share it with you guys at some point soon, but we are interviewing 100 people, so 20 people each within a week. And it's one of those things, that, like it's really intimidating at first, but once you go up and start talking to people, kind of like vlogging, 
uh, it gets a lot easier and people are a lot nicer than you'd think. So we have that, we have meeting, interview people, class, all back to back. It's a little bit packed in, but I think we can manage it, especially being in person. I couldn't imagine doing any of this online. <laughs> Hey, you doing good? How are you? We're gonna walk together. I do not agree. Oh my god, Jake, you're also going to class, right? Oh my gosh. I am. Uh, We're all gonna walk together. Hey. It's like you wear it the end. And just I am. <laughs> Unfortunately, my online class of the semester, which I kind of don't like, but we'll get through it. I cannot take online classes at my desk. That is the one thing I will not pay attention. So I take it on, I have an exercise bike. I'll show you guys. But if I'm on the exercise bike, at least I'm not on my phone. So I'm actually paying attention to the words that are being said. I, I know it would be better to fully take notes and be in class, but sitting on the bike, means that I'm not distracted on my phone or computer, and that's half the battle in my opinion. So we're gonna get changed up, get ready to bike, and take class from there. Pretty good one hour ride, got about 16 virtual miles in and definitely paid more attention in that class than I would have if I didn't ride. Now I have some dinner in the oven and then, I don't know, at this point in the night, I'll just see if my friends are up to anything, maybe hang out with them and we'll see where the night goes. Turns out all my friends are either not doing anything or they are with their girlfriends. So I'm gonna call it a night and do some studying, do some work and head to bed pretty early. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again soon. Peace out. Bye! Do I have work to do tonight? I mean, yes, I always do. So, I've had like no breakfast. No, it's stuck in my head.